in the liturgy today, St. Paul says that the eye has not seen, nor has the ear heard, and nor has it even entered into the heart of man what God has prepared for those that love him. This is heaven, right? Uh, he speaks about heaven. It's going to be so awesome, so beautiful. Here I am with this incredibly beautiful view, the lake behind me, the forest, the snow. This is what heaven is going to be like, but infinitely greater. But then in the gospel, the Lord speaks about cutting things off. We need to make the cut, right? In order to get into heaven, we're going to have to cut certain things off in order to get there. It's like climbing a mountain. If you want to climb a high mountain and you want to bring with you, um, you know, 20 gallons of water, and if you want to carry up a bed, and if you want to carry your favorite, um, you know, your, your favorite uh, things that you have at home, just way too many things, you're never going to make it. You have too much weight, too many things. You're not going to make it up the mountain. You're not going to be able to see this incredible view. In order to get up there, you got to cut things off, cut weight off, let things go in order to make it. So the Lord is telling us, yes, He wants us to get to heaven, but in order to get there, we got to cut things off, let things go. It says in the Gospel really clearly, cut off your hand if needed, rip out your eye if needed. Maybe we're all attached to something, someone that we need to just let go, cut it off, uh, be strong, um, in order to get up to the top of this view, get up to heaven. And we need the help of others too. Maybe ask a friend, ask someone you trust, a spiritual director, somebody to help you cut off anything in your life that needs to be cut off so we can make it to heaven. So be willing to cut things off. Make the cut now so that later you can make the cut and get into heaven.